I was just trying to figure out where we were. Uh, so last time uh, we we figured out that we can uh, go talk to a guy about where our ship is. Um, but we got some side quests because uh, that's going to take us off this area here. Um, got some side quests to talk to the TFS people. I think it's about like the suspicious we found like a suspicious blaster and then also at some point somebody um made an attempt on our life apparently i don't really remember that but hold on there's some kind of weird echo happening. I think I know why. Sorry. So, <laughs> if you don't notice, I was about to get to it. Um, I noticed the, the echo before. Anyways, I have added some funny uh, camera effects as you can see the mustache it's not real I, I promise you it is not real you like pop it off oh shit something ha something's happening Oh shit, okay, so... Moza is getting attacked? Dang, I am so slow at reading sometimes, guys. I need to figure out what the heck that was about. They're under attack, need, need my assistance. I have to get Moses' passkey. Okay, we'll, we'll keep an eye out for that. I'm not really sure how we're supposed to get that. Anyways, as I was saying, I added some... <laughs> Some funny, uh, camera filters, um, we've got a whole s assortment of them, and it's a channel point if anyone's interested in messing with it. Anyways, apparently when I added that, it, uh, it duplicated my, my mic, so there's that. Anyways, I'm just trying to get to a shuttle right now, I think is what we need to do. Where's the rest of my party as well? Oh well. Maybe they'll come with me. Or show up at some point here. Oh. Weird. We'll probably be okay by ourselves. Just need to find the TFS. The main TFS place. Yeah. TFS station. It's this way. But, yeah, uh, we're also doing a new schedule. Um, so I was experimenting with, like, a nocturnal schedule. <laughs> uh, it was fun, but um, I started waking up in the middle of my sleep and just not being able to go back to sleep, so, yeah. Uh, we, we switched and now we're doing, um, is it Mondays, Wednesdays, and Sundays at 11 p.m. EST. So hopefully more people, or a different group, uh, be able to come and make it. Those who couldn't stay up till like, <laughs> 6 a.m. 
but uh yeah hope that it uh works for people if not i mean hey it's what i gotta do so i apologize but uh let's see even the droid will help welcome to entertainment module 081's tsf station how may i be of assistance Okay, so he just tells me about the Ibn Hawk, but we already know that. I think we're... The TSF isn't cut out to handle all the problems on Citadel Station right now. We need Republic assistance. We'll, we'll ask around. Uh, we're, we're mainly looking for... Um, someone to tell us about the blaster. Something I can help you with? Yeah, I have a blaster I'd like to... Like you to look at? Blaster. Hmm. I don't see why not. What? Where did you get this? Yeah, I got ambushed on the dock module. Whatever the dock module is, I guess it's just the docks for the ships. Um one of the attackers attackers was carrying this. Interesting. This is no ordinary holdout blaster. It's been outfitted with a number of illegal modifications. You say you found illegal this modifications. Device. Shit. That is disturbing news. Disturbing indeed. Yeah, I guess why is that so disturbing? When off-world weapons are transported onto Citadel Station, whether they are personal arms or shipments to be resold, they are inspected and licensed by the TSF. This confirms my fear. That there is a source of black market weapons and components here on the station. I could use your help getting to the bottom of it. All right, do a little side quest, hunting down some thugs. Don't mind that. A relative stranger as yourself might be useful for the investigation. You'd be compensated, of course. Yeah, they won't see me coming. They'd be like, "Who is this dude?" It's Jedi. Yeah, I will see what I can do, good sir. Great. The first thing I would suggest is showing the blaster around, discreetly. See if anyone on the station knows something about it, or at least react suspiciously. There's more than a few people around here I'd suspect having a hand in this. Anyways, good luck. Let me know if you find the source of the blaster. Okay, uh, so we're right back where we started with the blaster. <laughs> Just ask around about it, I guess. Let me see what uh, what uh, the quest says now. Right, we're still not still not supposed to leave technically because we're under house arrest. But uh, I'm 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 gonna try to do these, do these side quests. Um, if they get too finicky or whatever, I'm just gonna pass on them. That's gonna be the whole game as well. Just not I'm not that kind of person. But um, yeah, we'll try to do the side quests and hopefully we'll get out of house arrest by then. But uh, if not, might be breaking the law. Blow this popsicle stand. Huh. Okay, it didn't really give us any... Any other, um... Information about the blaster, because, I mean... I guess we we're, we're supposed to just go around asking people about it, but that's not really... Does it sound fun? Or worthwhile, really? Moza's passkey. I'm not really sure where that's supposed to be. I kind of missed it in the conversation, so we'll probably pass that one up.
Okay, so the shuttle we need to take is in bay two. Dock module one, two, six. That's probably what we're gonna do next. Yeah, because that's nothing that's making our lightsaber. When we find one, um, yeah, let's just do that. That's what I'm most excited to do anyways. Seems like the main story. These side quests are very uh, vague. So. So dock two? Mod yeah, okay. This is a shuttle that's gonna take us over there. Really not sure what happened to my party. Dock to oh, okay, this here. Shuttle to Telos, please. Hey, get down. My cat loves ch to get on the back of chairs, but uh, this is quite the expensive chair. I usually have a blanket over it. I don't really yell at her to get down when it's on there, so uh, that's probably why. I probably should, but she just seems like she's having too much fun, and the blanket's protecting it. But it's a bad habit, I guess. Y'all get to see her every once in a while. Just open the door. Love it. Hello? What? Let me just check these. Okay. I think I've already been here before. Is I... Oh. You had to activate it twice, I think, is the, is the key. Yeah, 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 okay. There's even remains. Why did I not loot this stuff? Fuck yeah, I got grenades and shit. Guys, I'm feeling really energized right now. So I think that's really good. <laughs> it's good to be back. Good to be back. All right, we're heading to T Telos, I think. <gasps> no, did it crash? Okay, I didn't. Why did it kick me out of the game? That was weird. It's a bit weird. Yes, take the shuttle to the restoration zone, please, and don't crash my game. If that's possible. Karth. Admiral Onasi, this is Lieutenant Grant, TSF. He's from the first game, I'm pretty sure. Grant, it's nice to know that TSF hasn't gone to shambles in my absence. And how about you, an admiral? You might change your tune after you see what the situation is like down here, Karth. I've got some bad news for you. Well, it can't be that bad, Grant. I think Telos has already been through the worst. The one you came all the way out here to pick up, well, he managed to escape the station. We're not exactly sure how it happened. It's coming to pick me up. Am I hearing this right? I'll tell you more when I arrive, but the Republic has decided not to detain the exile and adopt the mm. wait and see approach. That's right, we're in exile, so. Then, like I said, we'll talk more when I arrive. Reasonable so for us will. to try to be I'm uploading the approach vector captured. Now. See you soon, Admiral. Kept under a uh, watch, you know. Kind of acting weird. Like it keeps flashing, like closing the window a bit. Like in between scenes. So hopefully it's fine. Sorry about it. I don't know what to do about that. Shit, we're hit. We're going down. Oh. Oh. That was a lucky little slide there.
And who are you, Spiky Head Man? Good to have you back, General. Sorry, what? He's got like a laser beam arm, that's kind of cool. I think we know what happened just yet. Where are we? Easy now. You survived one spectacular crash. Lucky I was here to pull you and your friends out of that shuttle, or you'd be more than a little. Unless we have like memory loss. But it's only fair. I owe you more than one, General. Mm, bumped her head too hard. Why does this guy owe me? How does he know me? Yeah, what is he talking about? In general? I guess maybe I could have been a general, but... I mean, I was a Jedi, so... Uh, or does he think I'm Karth? Maybe? Yeah, what's he talking about? He must be in shock from the crash. Have to expect some long-term memory loss from that. Too bad he's not a droid, huh? We can't all be that lucky. I'll humor you, General. I was one of the Iridonian mechanic corps that was at Malachor. There you go. I can see how you'd forget me, being that I was the only one. Hmm, we were on Malachor together? Is that what this is? Okay, there's an option that I might recall him. It's interesting, they like inject some um, story like within the questions you can ask. I think it's guiding me to this one. So I'd like to know how I recall him, like what our connection is. Don't think too hard. I'd rather not talk about the war if we could. We all went through some tough times after Malachor, and maybe we all did a little forgetting. Guess that's one thing we've got better than droids. They can't forget anything. But then you give them a memory wipe and they forget for good. Did we block him out from our like PTSD or something? It's not that far-fetched. Definitely a thing that can happen. Uh, how are the others? I assume we mean our crew. They'll be fine. The pilot's more or less unharmed and the old lady, well, she's tougher than she looks. You know, I never thought I'd see you again, General. Galaxy's a big place. And this is the last place I thought I'd bump into you. So I have to ask, just what are you doing here? Uh, I could ask you the same. Yeah, told, I was told I might find my ship here. Well, if your ship's in as bad shape as this one, I don't think you're going to have much luck. <sighs> well, this is familiar. Feels like my last time on Telos. Crashed the shuttle that time, too? No, Pazak. <laughs> that was not the most pleasant landing I've endured. Next time, we should perhaps seek out a more reputable pilot. You're welcome, Kreia. You know, if I weren't such a crack pilot, we could have hit the shield wall or one of those rock faces. Yes, our current situation is a vast improvement. I love party banter. This game so far is very good with that. Fucking add-on and... Kira just hate each other. <laughs> I hate Adon too. He's, he's such an asshole. Uh, I think. Yeah, what shot us down? I'm pretty sure that was just like the orbital defense shit. Like, we're not supposed to be here. Yeah, we should probably get out of here before some mercenaries or some shit show up. They're probably already on their way. My thoughts exactly. Let's get on then. Maybe we should leave him here. No. I'd much rather... Dude, if I can replace Add-on with this dude, I'd... Yeah. Definitely. Actually, I don't know. The banter is too good. Let me know, what do you guys think? Should If we can replace add-on with the spiky head dude, I don't know, we, I don't think it said his name yet, but should we do that? Or we keep an add-on to fight with Kira? <laughs> yeah, let's just get to the ship. But we don't have any idea where to look for the Evan Hawk. I can help you find it. I have access to the shield network. I came hoping to repair whatever damage your shuttle took, but not even I can fix that wreck. <laughs> yeah.
Yeah, there's no fix in that ship that we just went down on, that's for sure. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's find our ship. Oh, we're, yep, we're already being watched. As to be ex Oh, there they are, right there. Okay, he's joined the party. He possesses a special ability to rend and destroy force fields. Ooh. Shield breaker ability. Use it in combat to disrupt enemy force fields. Nice. Uh... Okay, well. Remove add. Okay, well. How do we change our party? There we go. Yeah, we want to remove you just for now. What? Oh, right, and Kira, we want. Shit, what did I do? There we go. That was weird. It wasn't like updating on the bottom right, so I was a bit confused. Yeah, let's auto level you up, bud. And we can kit him out as well. Probably should. Sure. Give you the implant. Um. Just add stealth, so that's not really good, but the mask is kind of cool. You can hold that for us. Actually, I'm going to forget that he has that on. We'll take that off, because it's not really doing anything if we're not in poison. There we go. Like, double click to take it off. Damage plus four. Defense one, okay. Got a contender. Yeah, we'll go with the damage or defend bonus. Always. Shields, not using them. Not right now. Demolitions plus one. Maybe you'll use some grenades or some shit. You know, we'll just give them two-handed blaster because it's easier to keep track of the damage. 110, 111, 112. Yes, yes. Okay, cool. Q. All right. Um... What does our quest say now? Shield network computer console, okay. Okay, well... Pretty much one place to go. I appreciate that game, not making it too confusing. Oh, there's some mines. Why is there so many mines? It's like a minefield. Right where we need to go. That sentry droid probably spotted us already. They were probably looking for me when they saw your shuttle go down. Alright, so yeah, we definitely need to go that way. I kind of want to... <laughs> do a quick save and try to pick some of these up, I think. The mercenaries have at least two hidden caches like this. We should keep our eyes open. Oh. Is there some loot to be had here? We're gonna get blowed up. Skill too low, okay. Can we disarm? Okay, nice. Uh, can this guy pick him up though? He seems, he's, he seems like an engineer. Well, it looks like a mechanic if I ever did see one. Hell yeah. 
clutch, dude. So happy to have you in the party. Gib all mines from now on. You me looking all stoic back there. Damn. God damn. Is this a better rifle for him? I think the one we have is what, 112? A 1 to 12? Seemingly not. I think it was one of the same that he already had. That's alright. Nice. Do a little save. Alright. Bring it on. Let's get it on. Uh, I can't attack. My depth perception off. I guess that robot is the closest thing. Um... Here we go. Definitely not. Yeah, let's get at this guy here. Oh! Someone's running up. What was cancel combat? I think it's a Y or something. Yeah, let's group up on him. Ooh, I think we're supposed to use... Special ability on from this guy? How do we do that, though? Oh, yeah. <laughs> we didn't set this guy's combat style. Alright. Because I know it said he had some like special ability to get through shields or something, but it looks like we're doing damage. Just slowly. Damn cheater. Using shields and stuff like a little bitch. Alright, Kira, where are you going? You going over here? I'll follow. Always important to try to attack the same things. I'll focus one thing down. Usually goes better for every everyone involved. I'm so excited to get my lightsaber though. Oh, what the fuck? Is that new? Are we getting new moves as we level up? I just kicked that dude in the chest. <laughs> that was cool. I've always appreciated the, um, wait, can I ride this bitch? No, surely not. What? What? Is that a thing? Is that a thing? Can I ride these? Anyways. What was I saying? Oh, I've always appreciated... Oh, code locked. I can't use it. Fuck. Same with this, huh? Well, then. Um... I've appreciated the animations of the fights. Like, it uh, locks you in and you're doing, like, actual little, like, saber moves and locking blades with people and stuff. It's, it's, it's very interesting to look at. Another sentry droid. Makes you really feel like the you're in a fight. Must be using them to locate us. There's probably another patrol nearby. Let's get him. I really love, specifically in this game, so far. I don't, I don't remember it from the first game, but the deflecting bullets with, like. Straight up Neo style, you don't really see that in um in the movies at all. That I've seen. Can we try to let this guy come to us. Or oh shit, are we gonna run through the mine? Can I cancel. Let's be smart about this. 
Kira, don't run through the mine. You dumb bitch. Oh, I didn't do that much damage. Anyways, yeah, the... Blocking blaster bolts with the force. Never really seen that outside of this game, I don't think. Very cool, though. At some point, we get, to, we get to do that with our lightsaber, too. I think I already have it unlocked, actually. Oh, it just naively thought that it would work with swords as well. What's cool, though, is the MMO also has this kind of this animations. Unlike World of Warcraft and basically every other MMO that I know of, there's no, like, they don't have any uh, variations to their their auto attacks, but uh, it's like really scripted in the Star Wars MMO just like this. It's pretty neat. I mean, it is re it, it repeats, but like, it's still co pretty cool. I think it has a chance to do some like unique animations every once in a while. Is this thing gonna attack me? Nah, he's chill. They're chilling. Maybe I should just kill him to get some loot. What do you guys think? I say why not? The more the merrier. You're kinda weak. No, cancel combat isn't. That's right, I'm just gonna click it. I know that there's a key binding, but I don't really feel like fucking with it right now. Dang. Oh shit, she force pushed him. Nice. Dude, carry kicks ass. So far, the AI, like my party members, are actually really strong in this game. The service of Telos. The Athorians are truly amazing in their work. Force is strong here. Whether Chodo and his herd has anything to do with that is another matter. Can you feel anything? Can you feel anything? No. I'm numb to the world. Feel nothing but the blackness of my soul. I see. Even that may be a good sign. Perhaps what you feel is the emptiness of the planet. It's pain. We should press on. Look. No, I'm pretty sure it's just my pain. <laughs> If we move carefully along the perimeter, we may be able to get by without their spotting us. We could cross along the shore, or head along the cliffs to the south. Are you suggesting stealth, good sir? I don't think you know who I am. Not gonna happen. Yeah, no need to hide. Let's take them all out. Bold. All right. Let's do it. <laughs> it's like, all right then. You crazy bastard. However, first, let's go loot this shit over here. Take out these... I didn't see the names of these. Canuck? Canucks? Isn't a Canuck... Uh, I feel like that's a slur. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't say that. Or it's like a... Um, it's either a racial slur, which I apologize. Um... Or a uh, hockey team. Pretty sure it's just a hockey team. Though. It just sounds bad. <laughs> As hyping up the animations with like the animation here, blocking the uh, the ca the cannot. Cannot make sure it's distinct, just in case. Um, this is a little weird. Hey, we're so strong though. I'm not taking any damage. I love it. Seems like this game's gonna be a bit easier, which I I appreciate. I just want to have you know some interesting combat. Nothing too challenging. Focus on story. Nice. All right, we'll let Kira get her her force back before we rush into those dudes. Oh, shit. What's it? Is this an Athorian? 
Yeah, I guess so. His neck's really weird. Like, kinked. He's got a radical on him, like I can loot him, but I don't think he has anything on him. Empty. Okay. Is there any way to get her force back faster? I don't think so. Battle meditation. Uh, I don't think so. It's so it's it's coming back though. We'll just wait a couple seconds here. Anything else we could do before we head over there? I don't think so. Something's over that way, but uh, just to be safe, we'll we'll do a save since we're not exactly ready to go. We're just gonna go for it though. Give me the sky out front. Coming right for you, fools. Okay, hold on. Getting intercepted by one of their pets, I think. Do they tame one of these? Yeah, juice me up, Kira. Let's go. Fuck him up. Ooh, I'm not using my abilities. I'm like an idiot. Who are you fighting, Kira? She was, she was having a little think. Need to watch my health here. So they're kind of kicking our ass a bit. Especially this guy with his shield. Gonna be an issue. Should I grenade him? Is that gonna help? What kind of grenades? We got Ion, Sonic. Sonic Detonator Frag. I'm gonna try Ion. Is that gonna hurt me too? Let's go find out. Oh shit, it does. Did it? I think it might have, uh. I think we're gonna throw another one inevitably here. Yeah. It did not break his shield. Alright. Kira is out of force juice. Need to watch her health. This guy's almost dead. We got a bunch of health backs. Pretty sure. Okay, well. It, we have like. Six normal med packs, two advance. I think we'll be alright. Join Kira over here. Kira's fucking heel tanking, I love it. I kind of wish that there was a, like a taunt. Maybe you can get a taunt at some point. That'd be neat. Just to keep the fire off of Kira. She's healing us. Protect the healer at all costs. Where's she going? Kira? Kira! Okay, well. I'm just gonna start attacking this guy. Oh, he just... <laughs> that was kind of weird. He just like... Bleh. Just fell down. He, like, skipped some frames there and he's just teleported to the ground. Nice. Hey, we didn't even have to use any pa med packs or anything. Very cool. I feel like that could have gone way worse. Hey! Uh, Nanaki? Nanaki, is that how you say, say your name? Thank you, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. 
How are you doing today? We're just kicking ass and taking names out here. Hmm, do we go right or left here? We're trying to find some, um, a console? So we can try to locate our ship, I, I, I'm pretty sure is the plan. It's like there's some kind of, oh, is this a, like a gorge? Oh, just walk around here. Ooh, it's like the second stash, yeah. our home dog. I need to figure out this guy's name, what is his name? I don't know. So, what do I call you? Bo Dur. I'm gonna just say Bo. Bo told us that uh, we, we found one of these caches surrounded by mines. He said there's another one. I think it's this. That was a betting man. The other one didn't, didn't really have anything. I mean, maybe because I've been looting every fucking thing in the game. We already had like two of everything that it gave, it gave us. Hey, we can level up. Just auto leveling my party members because yes, too tedious for me. Seems to be doing amazing. Here is a fucking boss Let's go. by this point. <laughs> Shit, I just clicked on it. I'm not really sure what that did. Did we pick it up? Who knows? The world may Most never know. Have at least two hidden caches like this. We should keep our eyes open. Have at least two. Yeah, that's exactly what he said at the last one. But um, we already got the first one. Oh, <gasps> yo, what? What is that novice robe? That, that looks cool. I might have to <laughs> drop my heavy armor. I don't know. The rule of cool. Unless it's like somehow better. Nah. I don't know. Let's throw it on. What does it look like? I don't know. It looks a little lame. I, I like the shininess and the defense of the heavy armor, gotta say. Uh, can one of you guys use it, though? Mm-hmm. He's got nothing in that slot. Nothing available, yeah. Can Kira wear it? Yeah. If anyone needs it, she does, because it has pluses to force powers. We're not really... Well, we, we picked the mixed build, because I didn't really know what I was going to go for. Uh, now that the game kind of seems a bit easy, easier than the first game, uh, I might, might lay off a bit on the... Uh... Ooh, that's a bunch of med packs, hell yeah. Might lay off a bit on the straight tank build that I'm running, but it seems to be working re pretty well. I like the look of the heavy armor too, so I don't know. I just know when I played the first game, it was like surprisingly hard, even on easy. So I was a little concerned that would be the case, but we're kind of just kicking ass. Feels good. Here's fucking OP. The AI seems to be really good in this game. No idea what I just picked up. I accidentally clicked, like, immediately. Missed what it was. It's alright. We'll, we'll figure it out later. I'm sure. Although I haven't had to empty my bags at all, so I don't, I don't think there's any, like, Max uh, inventory size, and uh, I haven't really had to sell much, aside from uh, making some money for a quest, and I only had to sell a couple things for that. I'm gonna yoink all of these, I think, unless we're gonna get shot at. We'll try. We'll, we'll try to pick them up. At least, yeah, we'll do a path. Okay, now they're shooting at us, right? Okay, idiot. I, I was just complimenting the AI, but nope, we're 
We're going for it. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Dude, we're doing front flips and shit now? Okay, I... Alright, we're picking up... <laughs> Chaos. Chaos is all that's happening right now. How the fuck did we get... We're doing front flips and shit now? What the hell? You know what's crazy is, like, I looked up... Because I wanted to make sure what kind of lightsaber I was going to want. So I, like, looked up all the, uh, the animations for all the different kinds. And not once in all the combat that I watched, was probably, like, a total of an hour, did I see a fucking flip. So I think I picked the right... <laughs> I think I picked the right setup. Uh, I, I really like how the uh, one-handed... One-handed? Just the single saber looked. L looks like more controlled. I've always thought that the dual wield is kind of like... You know, unironically un or ironically unwieldy. Like it looks like it's just a chaos. Like, you, like who could really handle that, right? And for the most part in history, it's not like even a thing. Like no one ever did that. It's just not really like helpful at all. Uh, I guess it kind of just looks cool to some people, but not me really. And then the saber, st the saber staff, has its points. It could be good. I just don't really like how it looks. You're like too locked down. You're like, ying, ying, ying. I feel like you're much more uh, versatile with just, you know, a traditional blade. Plus just the nostalgia, you know? Elegant weapon. Civilized age. That sort of thing. We do have, um... Oh, hello. Oh, did I break your turrets? Destroy him. Uh, you'll try. <laughs> I'm just gonna run right through these. Fuck it. They seem to like do no damage, really. Okay, I'm taking it. She's the boss here. She probably has the most health. I'm gonna take her droids out. Yeah, she's got a fucking shield on her. Oh, can I? There we go. We didn't change targets. Is it not gonna let me? There we go. Focus down these droids first. Ooh, that fucking whatever weapon she has kind of looks cool. It's like a little. Is that a dagger? Like a baton. It's kind of a cool shot. My stance is a little wonky, but <laughs> it's pretty neat. Pause, champ. Action here. All right, take the sword out. Oh shit! You're almost dead. How? What, what are you doing back here, bud? I'm assuming life support med pack is probably the biggest heal here. Is that wrong? I'm just gonna try to use the ones I have the most of first. What? Oh, okay. He's not in combat for whatever reason, which is weird. Here we go. Nice. I also don't know if I should be using other attacks, but uh, the critical one seems to do pretty well if I just spam it. Also, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to be using some sort of... Okay, well, her shields are down now. Uh, Bo is supposed to have some sort of... Uh special attack that I'm not sure how to act activate to take down shields, I think. Okay. Oh, we'll yoink these and then we'll level up.
Okay, let's see. Well, let's not forget to loot here. Just a repair kit. All right. Let's see what we can do. Unarmed specialist. Oh, it's granted it. Weird. Not really doing unarmed things that I know of. Treat injury, important. Um, probably persuade because we can get out of fights. Then I, uh, yeah, it's either or for those. Um, and I have one point to put on something else. It seems like demolitions. Dem oh. What? Is that gonna take like two or something? Okay, can we do repair? Okay, that's fine. That'll do for now. We got one. We're still rocking heavy armor, I think, is the way to go. So, restricted by armor, restricted, restricted, restricted. This one is not. We can upgrade that. Although we're not using that, this is a force power. We're not really using any force powers, but we could. If there's nothing else. Yeah, this one seems to be pretty much the same thing. It's just this one is better, so I'm going to hold off on that one. What does this do, by the way? I needed to know if this regenerates uh, your force power. Okay, no, it just, it just heals you. Yeah, it's drain your health. That's never good. Restricted by armor. Effect mind. Ooh. I don't think that this is an ability more. It just, it's like you get Jedi mind trick. So we might take that one actually. That could be interesting. Stun. Yeah, I think I still want right now anyways. I want that Jedi mind trick over any like attacks. Push, drain line. Uh yeah, we don't we don't have we don't have our lightsaber yet, so we we're, we'll get that. We'll get there. Drain life, force scream. And we get let me get this effect mind. If it works how I think it does, it should be pretty good. It's kind of risky. This game, you can't uh, undo. <laughs> you can't like respec as far as I'm aware. Maybe you could get something later in the game or pay like a Jedi Master or something to uh, change your abilities, retrain you at some point. That'd be neat. Uh huh. Yeah, we need to find a console. Is what we're doing. There's the landing pad. There should be a computer terminal I can access from there. Looks like we're gonna have to find our way there, though. Look sharp. What do we have here? Ooh, that mask looks cool. Saves us the trouble of looking for you. Corin Fault did say you were dangerous. Maybe he does know what he's talking about. Ooh, I would pay them, but I really want this guy's mask, and I hope it drops. <laughs> um, yeah, who's this guy exactly? He's some kind of bounty hunter? Fault hired me to keep everyone out of the restoration zone. You in particular. I see. I see.
Why, yeah, what's what's down here that's so uh, valuable? A grenade with your name on it. Jedi. Ooh. Attack. Wise guy, I see. Okay, he's the leader, so let's head for this guy first. This what I'm seeing, I got three chances to get this. Oh, we're so fast. Three chances to get this, uh... You know, maybe we should attack people that don't have the shields on and they run out at some point. Is that how that works? Although Kira's just going for it. Still might be better, I think. Okay. You're the big boss. Let's try to take you out first. Ooh, maybe not turn my back to the big guy, but... We'll be alright. We'll make it work. We need to pay, pay attention. Didn't have my skills... My single attack queued up there. I don't know, this guy looks pretty cool with his, uh, staff. Maybe we'll have to try it out if we can. We'll definitely go for the single, you know, the traditional single saber. Oh, who, who else is attacking? The whole base coming after us? Fuck. Was not prepared for this battle. Maybe we were. Alright, Kira. See you. Follow you. I would die for Kira. Okay, she's about to die herself, though, so she needs to chill the fuck out. Anyways, I was saying... What? Okay. Let's make sure she gets healed up. I was saying... Maybe I'll try... Once I get my main lightsaber, if I ever get enough parts or whatever. We could try the Saber Staff, I think. See, so yeah, if, if anything, I think that's the cooler option rather than the dual wield. Oh god, you're getting fucked up back here, huh? We're running out of med packs fast. <laughs> Jesus. Oh man, there's like a whole nother squad. There's a bunch of dudes here. This is bad. This is bad. I think this is gonna be an issue. Alright, um... These are pretty weak med packs though. Okay, try one more. Where's your fucking... Why, why are you kicking him? Sir. Where's your blaster? Did it break? Oh, I like put it on the wrong... What the fuck? I put it on the wrong setup. Wrong set or whatever. That's funny. Uh, so we should have been doing much better. Alright, well... 1 to 10. What? No description. What the fuck? If we die, we know why. Home dog didn't have a blaster rifle at all. There we go. Alright. Please use your blaster. Once I get healed up here. Okay. Should be kind of fine, um... That's right, I do have Force Heal myself. We're in a real bind. Okay. I guess, did he deal with whoever was down there? If so, what a fucking hero.
Oh yeah, we're... Oh shit. I was about to praise us here. Okay, we have like five. Luckily five of these. You know what, I should probably be using my my main guy's heal on him before using med packs. Oh my god, he's getting destroyed! <laughs> he's probably gonna die. We'll keep trying to heal him. Okay, he's big dead. Damn. The fuck? Can I pick him up? No, I got the skill. Revitalize, I think is what it is, but... I think we need force for that, huh? Alright, well... We tried. Yeah, we might have to do this fight again. <laughs> With our guy actually using a flaster. <laughs> This music is fitting. It's like chaos. I think we might have this though. As long as these dudes don't attack us. Fuck, there's like four left. We need to. We need some way to get back. Force. If anyone knows how you're supposed to do that, be very valuable right now. <laughs> Can we all just chill out after we kill this guy? Yeah! <laughs> Kirit says no, I guess. Okay, can we cheese this? Alright, he's back up. He's back up. <laughs> okay, let's loot up here. Let him get his health back. Nice. I love it. I love it. Alright, we're gonna definitely quick save. I don't think... <laughs> I don't think we we're supposed to be able to have a little break. Yeah, this, we can look at the control panel too. Maybe we shouldn't go too close to the edge over here. Is this an upgrade for us? Or is it still just a neural band? Dexterity. Do we get bonus feats for blaster pistol and rifle? Okay. That needs to go... on our friend Bo. He thinks... Okay. Alright, you just rest up, alright, bud? General, need some Okay, I didn't want to talk. Not yet. Not right now. We're a little busy. Okay, maybe we should just heal him up. Oh yeah, we still gotta look at this. Cool. Hopefully I'll be able to access the shield network from this console. Good, it's functional. And my passcodes still work. Now let's find your ship. Yeah, uh, they said that my ship wasn't at any sanctioned site, so... Uh, guess how are we gonna find it? The TSF probably thinks the ship was put down in the wastes, but they don't know the planet as well as I do. Telos's atmosphere has been turned into acidic vapor. Landing a ship in the wastes would be like sealing it in a hangar full of hungry Minox. So that means there's probably an unsanctioned landing site somewhere on the planet. Still shielded, but not a restoration zone or other listed facility. That's why I need access to the shield network. Here, a small anomaly in the shield network's power grid. I'm not surprised the TSF didn't spot this. It's subtle, more like an error or random flux than anything suspicious. <laughs> nice. So I think we found 
where a ship would be. Some secret place. It looks like power is being drawn to generate a shield over a small area in the polar region, but nothing should be down there. Orbital cameras show nothing, just an empty mesa. We should investigate this. I feel this is the best bet of finding the Ebon Hawk. Yeah, how do we get how do we get to this polar region? Also, I'm pretty sure our guy should be at full health. Or that would be really cool if he was <laughs> when we come out of this uh, this little conversation. We'll see. It's a little tougher. According to the computer, a shuttle is currently docked inside the research facility. At least there was at last report, though that was months ago. We also need to um, go loot all that stuff. Hopefully, hopefully we can get one of those masks. That's pretty cool. I think they look neat, even though we're light side. They look a bit menacing, but uh, yeah. to each their own. Yeah, no promises the shuttle's gonna be there, so. I don't, but that's not going to stop me. I'm getting back to. Yeah, we gotta try. To build a new ship myself. Come on, then. There's one other small problem. Recently, Zerka teams that were sent to the military facility have not been coming out. But it's not as though we have any choice. This is true. Yeah, so let's go. Question? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. What? Why is there just a droid here? Oh, is it that guy's? Is it Bo's? That's cool. Unexpected. All right, yeah. Let's make sure we loot all this stuff. Probably advantageous. Okay, yeah. They're are they gonna start attacking us? Yes. <laughs> okay. Okay. Cool. That's fine. We got this. Focus. I was gonna try to loot before um, we take on the rest of these guys, but I don't think it's that big of a deal. We'll be okay. Just would have been cool to have like a bit more armor, probably, just in case. These guys don't seem to have shields, though. Damn. His, uh... I like their swords. They're just, like, really plain, kind of. But that's kind of cool, in a way. So clean-looking. Can I open this? There we go. Stuck on the geometry combat suit. Can Bo wear that? Maybe you just can't change his uh, chest piece. Oh, you can. But it might not update the same as uh, Kira's because he's got like a really unique uh, looking armor on. And his arm, the whole arm situation, probably hard to change that. Okay, I put this on, bud. Oh, it did update, that's kind of neat. I guess you just kind of like erase this part as far as game design. Still not sure why you can't update Kira's. Oh, she could. That'd be neat. I like to see what's. What was that? Was that a grip? Just a grip. Yeah. Twas a grip. Okay, let's still try to just loot. I are these all key coded or whatever? I don't know what I would do with them. It's just I want to try to ride them. <laughs> Let me ride it. Disruptor rifle. Should probably just look at um Okay. It's not better. So he's got like a one to twelve. Did I throw that on him? On accident? I think I did. I did. No, because you have a one to twelve available. Definitely use that. Yeah, so just look at the attack, at least on the ri on the rifles, because I keep getting a bunch of them. And I know for sure he has a 1 to 12. 
tank. Weapon. I don't know what, um... What our swords are right now. But... Yeah? Pick this shit up. I'm gonna explore this place. I like being a little loot goblin. Taking everything. Never know when you'll need it. Oh shit, okay, well... <laughs> uh, that's not how that's done. Can we go in there? We gotta fight these other dudes over here. Another chance to get one of these masks. The mask will be mine? Pretty sure I've seen people wearing these masks on their characters. I don't wish me luck in the loot. Credits. Fuck. It's not like I can buy one of these masks. Can't go in here. It, it, it's lit up. Like, the doorway is lit up. Just let me live my life. Can I please go in there? Why do you cuck me so, game? Can't believe you've done this. Was there anything behind these? Mm. Hard to see when I'm running. There's no jump. No jumping. No jumping allowed. I don't think we can get behind here. There might be some hidden... Treasure. Nope. Alright, I think that's it for this area. Just maybe back this way there could be something. Nope. Alright, let's check out this military base. I don't think... So I think all those guys are mercenaries. I don't think that there's, there'll be any any more masks in here, but uh, fingers crossed. Really want one. Oh, hello. Oh, shit. Hey, I don't have an antidote. It's not cool. Like smells like poison. It's Cause it is! Shit. Um. Okay, that didn't heal us. Can't throw an energy resistance on myself. Ooh, that did something. Did it just wear off? Uh, he's still suffering. Here, I fix him up. Do we have? Maybe that did it? No, he's still... <laughs> stop dying! Okay. Just have to yell, yell at him, and then he'll stop dying. Oh. Let's go. Is it specifically this that he can do stuff with? No, we have a shit ton of mines, though. Alright. Let's just blow this shit. We'll use one of the 15. Oh. Okay, that didn't work. <laughs> we bash through, is it gonna do anything? This arm of mine isn't just for show, General. Stand back. Oh, it's not some it's not something that you activate, it's like a little cutscene. The Zerka mercenaries were a little surprised when I broke my way out of my holding cell. The shields there were even weaker than these, after you. Yeah, I'm not even going to question how that... 
Makes sense and or works. I'm not really sure how. How that uh his fist works, but maybe when he like punches, there's like an EMP blast, a little, little tiny EMP blast that just affects things in front of it. it. Sounds very specific, if you ask me. Okay, we should definitely stop running over those heads. Kira, you're it. You're on the vent. <laughs> Stop. This won't take long. This won't take long. Did we do it? Did we kill that other one? No. We just line aside it like a pro. It's my wow skills kicking in. They can't see you. They can't shoot you. That's not always true. There's, there's been some really wonky, uh... Specifically on, like, Warsong Gulch? No. It's the other one. It's like the newer version. I forget what the name is. But, uh, like, some of the rocks, there's, like, these big boulders that are taller than your character. That seem like they should be able to line of sight you. Like, a... a Interrupt the line of sight and like cancel people's attacks, but they just go right through it and it's really annoying. Okay, you're about yeah. to be big dead. Uh, hopefully nothing bad happens here. But we'll just let you recover on your own. Maybe turn off the poison. Deactivate turrets, yes. Sure, we'll snag the map. Don't know how that's gonna help, but uh, yeah. Oh, okay, just like that. <laughs> um, what were we looking for in here? To be fair, oh, find a shuttle from here. Wait, right, hangar base somewhere? Reactor. I kind of want to explore this whole place though, so. Workbench. Maybe we can craft our lightsaber here. <laughs> Be impromptu, kind of, but uh. Okay, the hangar's over here. Maybe it's unwise to try to search this whole place, but I want the loot. The experience, you know? General? Need. I don't want to talk to you. I'm just trying to change to you. Let's go. You know, it's kind of intuitive to click on you to do that, but uh, do I just attack it with him? Oh. Oh. I guess so. And you're getting beamed. I should probably heal you. seed hard. Alright, stay alive, please. We're gonna go kill this thing. Did I not turn off the turrets? I guess these are just droids. They're, they're mobile, they're not turrets. Is that all that constitutes a turret? Just... They're not mobile. They're locked in place. I don't know why that seems wrong. But those are weird. Do they like hop around? The weird gangly leg. They're mono leg. Single leg. We'll do our patented, uh, Always go right option here. Okay, we can't go through this door.
Keep trying to auto move. I've been playing WoW way too much. There's just no other good games out right now. And all the games I would want to play, I would like to save for, um, for stream. But uh, yeah, I, I don't even like want to play those in my free time though. Really. Aside from, like, wanting to save them for stream, if that makes sense. I'm just, like, really not in the mood to, like, play a story, a story game off stream at the moment. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm not mad about playing WoW, but um, I just kind of wish that there was something more... Uh, I really want the new expansion to come out. If that's what it is. And, uh... So I can play. Cause they talk about ranked, ranked team um, battlegrounds. All right, here I'm gonna need you to heal yourself. You make me nervous. Okay, she's not gonna heal herself. So I gotta do it. I gotta do everything around here, Kira. Stressing me out. So keep yourself alive so you can heal us. That's probably good enough. Anyways, yeah, they're releasing... Said that they were... Finally. Uh, solo queue... And you can solo queue into a ranked team PvP match. Which sounds amazing. I've always wanted to do uh, rated battlegrounds, but uh, it's like really... It's really hard to get a good team together. Or just get a team together at all. It's really convoluted. Uh, you gotta do it like in a private group. Basically you have to have a guild and stuff. I, I tried to head one before. It was not ideal. It was a lot of stress. <laughs> I, I, I'm not a good um, raid leader or like battle master or whatever you want to call it. Yeah. Shot collar kind of thing. Yeah, I'm not sure how this is working, but it's it's doing the thing. We'll just take it. Take it and run. Oh, what the fuck? Why are these Why are these turrets on? I thought I turned them off. Maybe it's just that uh that one area. That's fine. I'm not worried. Are you, are you guys worried? I'm a little worried. <laughs> Look at all these buffs on me, though. Is that like four? You've done well, Kira. Let us end this. Where are you going? Middle guy? Alright, I'm there. Right through poison. No antidote needed. We probably need some, but we don't have any. No big deal. We can heal through it, I think. We're almost done here. Unless. A nuke spontaneously drops on us. I think we're going to be all right. Just keep an eye. Okay, cool. Oh shit, I got locked in place. All right, good, 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 good. That was almost bad. At the very beginning of our playthrough, we realized that something with the, the resolution of the game, after fighting sometimes you get locked in place and just frozen there. I thought I fixed it, but we kind of were there. For a second. Okay, let's try to... It's the first workbench we've found since we got the hilt of a lightsaber. I think maybe we need to find more parts to it, though. 
Upgrade items? Lightsaber? Or maybe we need a specific kind of bench. To craft things? To create... Okay. Um, melee? Lightsaber. Um, I'm not seeing where we create the lightsaber itself. Other. Or do I maybe need to craft one of each? One of each of these things to make my lightsaber? So what do we have? We have energy cell. Energy cell, an emitter, a lens. Yeah, I'll have to look into that. It's alright. Yeah? Don't think it says anything else. Crafting a lightsaber. You, you have found a lightsaber. Energy cell fixture. Perhaps some additional parts. With some additional parts, you'll be able to construct a lightsaber. I feel like it's like a quest, though. Could be wrong. Here's our shuttle. There she is, one orbital shuttle. Looks like it's in serviceable condition. That's all a moot point, though. Why is this moot? The hangar bay doors are closed. Mm -hmm. I don't fancy flying the shuttle through solid metal, so I say we need to find a way to get them open. We'll also need to find the ignition codes for the shuttle, or else we'll have some trouble getting off the ground. If we get all that, I wouldn't worry about what shape this heap is in. I'll get it running. You're making some fair points, sir. Alright, is there anything to loot in this? Yes. It doesn't look like there's anything in the hangar bay. Oh, what's this actually? Impossible. Fine. Why'd you let us try then? Okay, yeah. We're just continuing on. We need the shuttle codes and Shit. the fucking vents, man. <laughs> you idiots! Oh man, I I love AI sometimes. They 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 like purposely walked through the fucking vents. It's fine. Everything's fine. Unlock hangar doors. Okay, we gotta find the reactor and turn that on. And then we can open the doors. Uh, yeah. Let's open this. Get all the loot. Give all loot. 
What if there was a console command that just gave you every single item in the entire game? Would that crash your game? I feel like it might crash your game. But I would definitely name it if I was the coder. I would name it Gib Loot. <laughs> just give all loot. Thank God, is this gonna turn off all the gas in the whole place? Thank fucking God. Or is it just this? It's just probably this here because we turned off the turrets. We definitely turned off some turrets last time. And there was definitely some turrets active. Although we are unclear on the definition of what a turret is. <gasps> yes, we got the fucking... <laughs> we got the mask, dude. Dudes and dudettes and others. Damn it. It's happening! It's happening! Hmm. Defense one. I guess nothing else has defense on it. Heck yeah. Let's go. Looking dope. Uh, yeah, I guess we'll go this way. Since we're right here. Ah, it's a terminal that opens that door. It ain't that side. Yeah, luckily, a, kind of a good part of this game, it's simplicity of the faces. Like, I'm not opposed to keeping this mask on for the rest of the game. Because it's not like my character talks. <laughs> not like it's animated. I guess there's slight facial expressions, but it's like, eh, it's, it's hard to tell really what's going on with the face. And you will die now. Oh shit. Mufalawa ni bobo wish yo tkuna sita dorjuni sobawata. Part of a rescue team. Uh, depends. Who are you? Wana bota yuta tanga kinamatura tayaita ta. Ah, Zerka. Nah, sorry, but. <laughs> Find your own way out, you Zerka scum. I can't leave you. Watch me. Feel kind of bad. Maybe he didn't have a choice to work for Zerka. We we hate Zerka here, so Let's stick to our guns. We look so cool right now. <laughs> Wait. Okay, good. They can't shoot through there. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. Okay, their blaster fire is definitely coming through. Does it seem to be dam damaging us though? What? Okay, we gotta blow it up. Nice. Very stylish. Got the the saber saber twirl in there. <laughs> Sass 
zwei. Alright, let's get it on. Ooh. I like how we're getting new animation. I'm not sure how that works. I'm getting it with levels or what? Can we level up mid fight? This is too much power. Should not let me do this. Love it. Thank you, thank you, game, for being so damn cool. So nice. Dude. Why? I love this game. I'm in love. I think it just hit me. Big love for the game. I mean, I already loved the first one, so I'm not really sure, like... I guess I'm just not surprised at all. <laughs> but, yeah. Officially in love. We'll see if I'm... See if I'm not burned out. And if I uh, end up picking up the Star Wars MMO again. I don't know. Unexpectedly, I'm also kind of enjoying not having a lightsaber right now. It's kind of a cool aesthetic. Alright, treat injury, persuade, security, computer. Um, yeah, demolitions would be nice, but I guess we don't have enough. Keep going for awareness, I guess. A lightsaber form? Okay, we still don't have our saber yet. I feel like we're supposed to have it now. <laughs> but, uh, it's fine. Right, what's this? Dominate my dummy mommy? Shit. Okay, if we get that, that secure is like, we can control just about everyone, except for droids. It doesn't work on droids. Restricted by armor. I think that might be worth getting. Can't think of anything else I've seen that's better than that. They're like all attacks. We're not really using. Not really using force attacks at all. Sure, we'll go. We'll go for it. I'll take the bait. Hell yeah. But hopefully, we get to use that in some cool situations. I mean, our other option was just um, an emergency. Okay, we're gonna use this terminal. Some e emergency. Um... Ooh, get wrecked, all you droids! Get overloaded. What? Oh, do I have to use this one to unlock it? No? Was there one inside here? I miss? Nope.
I was saying something, but I lost my train of thought. Yeah? Let me handle this. Got a bad feeling about this. What are the chances that there's just a... Yeah, that's an assassin droid. Um, there's just an inquisitor in here somewhere, ready to kill me. Sure, we'll activate the droid. Uh, yeah, follow me. Okay, are you now part of the party? Hell yeah. Please don't murder me. Do not betray me, droid. I fucking... What the hell? Sir? <laughs> Did you just blow up? Why? But why? Is it because I didn't trust him? Magnetically sealed. Damn you to hell. Fucking magnets. Witchcraft. Righty. I was a betting man. Which I'm not. I'd say that back there is the way. The reactor. Also, kind of the only way we can go. So, I hear you. Let's go. Let's go. Kind of made this level our bitch. Turned everything off. Like a big brain boy. Start reactor. Yes. I was hesitating for a second. I'm like, do we want to do that? Am I in the room with the reactor? Am I gonna die of radiation poisoning? <laughs> but no, we need it on so that we can... Uh... That's like a tank or some shit, huh? Is that gonna come hunt us down? Are we totally fucked? Do I act activate this guy? Guess I can't. What's going on? What about engineer guy? Nope. Why is it even there then? Just decoration? Oh shit! Okay. Well, these are back on now. What? <laughs> Why? Wait, was this? I just realized that this lightsaber form was on my bar. I guess it, it was already activated though. I can't like turn it off here. I don't know why you would want to. But... It's interesting that it was there. Zoom. Mm. Yeah, so I apologize because uh, so I I wanted to have the updated content mod and I wanted to figure out how to turn off this blur effect. So it hurts my eyes. Um, turns out though, if, if I do that, I'm going to lose my saves at this point. And I had run out of uh, I'd run out of time when I started the game. I guess I could have like postponed, but I, I didn't really want to. It's fine. It's still it's still fun to experience the um, just the vanilla version of a game. I think it's well worth it. Okay, so we just gotta get back to the hangar. Yeah, let's go. Well, let's go. Yeah, maybe at some point. Um, 
yeah, I think I, will, I'll, I will want it to be a while, but I would like at some point, maybe like next year or something, to come back and play this again, but as a Sith. That'd be neat. There's a couple other games that I, I would like, probably in the next, definitely within the next year, um, yeah. I'd be okay with playing. For a second time, uh, and doing a evil playthrough, like a uh, cyberpunk. Um, I know there's a couple other others. I can't really think of them right now. But definitely, cyberpunk would be neat. Cool, we're like a gang or something. Look at us, little matching masks. Ooh, we got the ignition codes too. I think we're all, all good to go. I'm pretty sure there was only two things that we needed. Uh, let's see what these gloves have to offer. We got plus one. Plus three defense, definitely taking that. And then we could probably give you my old gloves. I just got the same ones I had. Not better. They're the same ones. Okay. We'll just make sure we loot everything and then we should be able to get out of here. Maybe get to our ship. Kind of looking, looking forward to seeing a heavy combat suit. I feel like we've already had that before. But for me though. It's a heavy. Yeah, this is twice the defense, though. What I have on currently. Two times the defense. Um... No, I didn't want this. I want to try to give it to you if you can use it. A. Can he wear heavy armor? This is a light armor item. Maybe Kira should wear that, though. No, this... This has plus Wisdom. So maybe not. I'm pretty sure Wisdom gives you more Force Juices. Damn, yummy Force Juice. The keep... The keeps live in. <laughs> Keeps us live, Juice. Very, very important. This guy's just still chilling. Should we? Should we talk to him again and take us? Take take him with us? I don't trust him. It's dirty Zerka scum. Maybe some other time, bud. Sorry. Not this playthrough. All right, we out of this. I'm blowing this popsicle stand. Ooh, though we. It did open a special door. I think maybe it's gonna be a boss out here. Some giant thing. I kind of want to go find it. Oh. There you are. Tank droid. Well, uh, gonna, yeah. <laughs> Do a cheeky save here. Can we activate this to help us? Nope. Be hostile? Yes. Maybe it wasn't. Oh well, we will get the loot from it. You will die, so I can take your loot. Sorry, it's just the way it has to be. Okay. Well, you're kind of destroying us here. Uh -huh. 
It's killing me. Oh, there we go. I wish it was just like an AoE heal. Why is that not a thing in more games? Oh my god, he hits so hard. Throw the heal on there again. Like I want to, I want a character that I can just do damage while healing myself and everyone around me at the same time with just like one ability. Is that <laughs> is that too overpowered? Is that too much to ask ask for? She's down. Got a feeling I'm gonna have to. I'm glad I quick save. Oh. We die here. I'm gonna start chucking grenades at him. I think we might survive though. Okay, we do have health back, so I don't know why I'm not using them. I also don't know why it has to make me do this this way. <laughs> Didn't do it in time. Grenades it is. Frag grenade, ion, plasma. I don't know the differences in grenades, to be honest. We'll, we'll try one of each, how about that? I'll figure out which ones work the best against droids. Frag, ion, plasma, sonic. One of them's gotta work, right? Whatever that second one. Oh my god. Our health. <laughs> we did it! Hell yeah. Somehow we did it. Alright, let's get out of here. We have... That was probably dumb to walk in here. There could have been... Yeah, these turrets waiting for us. Looks like there's just loot though, which is nice. Okay, can we not get stuck on the wall? I think I had a bug crawling on me. I need to spray my apartment. It's about that time. My dad was kind enough to, um, Lend me his his bug spray. I just haven't gotten around to it. If I do that tomorrow, spray all my vents and stuff. I've been getting big old big old bugs, boogle bugs. I forgot I had this. <laughs> I intentionally, if you're wondering, intentionally put the mustache on, but I, I forgot momentarily that it was there. And I was like, what, is, what the fuck is that? Dex, Dex gloves? We don't want that. Nope. Oh, yeah. Maybe Kira could use it though. Unsure. Oh, yeah, she doesn't have any gloves on. It's probably not ideal. Some immunities. Some extra damage. I feel like if it's not defense, I don't really think immunities, they're like situational. So I'd probably want the attack more. Yeah, over dexterity as well. I will go with that. I didn't even re read what that was. Strength plus one? Well, she's doing melee shit, so it's probably good. Probably fine. Just making sure she has some decent stuff on, because I haven't looked at her kit in a while. Oh, you know what? One of us should have had this on in here. 
because it's immunity to poisons, but the level's over and gone. <laughs> A little too late. Dexterity plus two versus resist Sonic. Sure, that sounds a bit better. Yeah, we haven't really gotten any more swords. No swords. Kind of hoping for a new one, if not a lightsaber, in the near future. If not, it's not big, not that big a deal. Would just be neat. All right, we out of here. Oh, right, we need to go to the terminal. Oh, wow, that fully healed us. Hmm, a bit of an exploit. Bit of an exploit there. All right. Now let's get out of here. Let me make sure I save. I don't know if I did after the fight there. That we barely, barely won. Yes, yeah, so let's head to the polar region to find our ship. Fill up my water. My mug. Anyone know why it's like impossible to act, like not make a mess while pouring out of a coffee mug? What's the uh, we have arrived too late. The what's the physics with that? Us. We must pursue it. Observation: They have likely escaped aboard the orbital shuttle that has been docked here. The bay control computer likely will have a record of their departure. Query: Have you discovered anything about the shuttle's course? Answer. I have managed to track the shuttle's movement across the shield network. However, the shield network does not stretch over the polar region, which was the shuttle's apparent destination. Statement. Dispatch a unit to the polar region with the last known coordinates and approximate path of the shuttle. They will not escape us again. Not sure what that guy's deal was. Or why his buddy blew up when I like turned him on. Oh shit. Missile incoming. I'm gonna have to blow that shit up. Well, no. We we're down again. <laughs> this is like the third ship we've gone down in this game. I'm lucky. Seems like a trend. Seems like a trend. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> Irritated declaration. There you are. It has been extremely difficult to track you down. I love how they declare their emotions. Clarification. But now that we have found you, we Clarification. hope facilitate communications. Unnecessary addendum. And put an end to hostilities. It was unnecessary. Why? <laughs> Why did he say it? What, what was the point of that? Anyways. Uh, I was planning on watching something uh, around this time. I got a uh, request, actually, which was really surprising, on one of my um, on one of my YouTube videos to watch a uh, it's like a 40k Hell's Reach Part One. It's like a, another 40k fan made thing, I think. Uh, just let me get it queued up here. We'll check it out. Yeah, uh, if anyone else has anything that they would like me to watch, uh, don't be afraid to speak up.
love checking new things out. Not like I'm not yeah, I'm not even like really uh I I think um sorry, not Hell's Reach specifically, but at least I think that's I don't I don't know if that's how this is said or not. Anyways, I think 40k looks pretty cool. I just don't know a lot about it. Definitely like the aesthetic of it. I don't know if I'd ever play it though. Like make a um an army or anything like that myself. But I do enjoy the cinematics and whatnot. All right. Should be good to go here. I'll do a little intro for um for YouTube. All right, welcome guys. Uh I got a humble request to watch this uh this Hell's Reach um little animation. Uh it's another 40k thing, so Y'all seem to like that last Astartes thing. Uh, <laughs> I still have my mustache on, I just realized. <laughs> it's alright, we're rolling with it. We're, we're just gonna roll with it. The following work is unofficial. Okay. Yeah, it's a fan-made thing, right? Prologue. I will die on this world. Oh, this is so neat. I cannot tell where this conviction comes from. Whatever birthed it is a mystery to me. I love this animation the style. Clings like a virus, like sketchbook behind my eyes and taking deep root within my mind. It almost feels real enough to spread corruption to the rest of my body, like a true sickness. It will happen soon. Within the coming nights of blood and fire, I will draw my last breath, and when my brothers return to the stars, my ashes will be scattered over the priceless earth of this accursed world. Armageddon. War, it Even never changes. It's my blood until burning oil beats through my veins. I feel anger now. What is this Hot floating skull thing? Flowing through my heart and filtering into my limbs like boiling poison. My hands curl into fists. I am strong. Born only to slay for the Emperor and the Imperium. Is this supposed to be the voice I of this guy? Because it kind of... the blackest of the black. I don't know why. It doesn't like fit for me. I am guide as well as a war leader. I am wrath. Wrath incarnate. Living only to kill. That's metal as fuck. Finally killed. I am a weapon in the eternal crusade to forge humanity's mastership of the stars. Its strength, purity, and wrath will not be enough. I will die on this world. I will die on Armageddon. Well, that's really neat. <clears throat> I want to see more. Is this part two? Was this like two minutes? First one? Yeah, we'll watch another one. I want to see some, I want to see some, like, fighting. It's no way endorsed by Games Workshop. I guess that's who owns the copyright for, um, 40k. In the grim darkness of the far future, there's only, there's only wars. There is only war is what I think that said. There's some Halo vibes, kind of. Choir. Oh. <laughs> it's like a huge ship. Kind of hard to tell what some of this is on like my huge monitor. I, or I have a TV I'm looking at. Sizable TV. 
probably be easier if it was on like a little tinier screen. It still looks really cool though. Hell's Reach. By Aaron something? Not even gonna attempt to say that last name. <laughs> Aaron D. We'll go. We'll go with that. Aaron D. You are very talented. This floating head is weird. Is it just like a, a remote droid from In the holiest Star Wars? Of our ancient flagship, I lower myself to one knee and bow my head because this is what is asked of me. Grimaldus, High Marshal Helbrecht intoned. His voice was a guttural rumble. Rendered harsh from yelling orders and battle cries in a hundred wars and a hundred worlds. We have summoned you to be just. <laughs> I don't know about these voices. <laughs> I have answered the summons. I submit myself before your judgment, my liege. Mardred is dead. Helbrick's voice was a deep murmur. Slain by the arch enemy. Kind of sounds like the Emperor, Emperor's like Emperor Palpatine. We have all of us lost a brother. I don't know what it I was, was expecting the sound like, but it wasn't this. Was <laughs> that upon his death, you would be worthiest of our brother chaplains to stand in his stead. His final decree was that you, of all your brethren, would be the one to rise to the rank of Reclusia. The figure inclined his head in greeting. Arterium, we draw near to our destination. I took the liberty of readying the squad for Planetfall. This world will burn. It will not be the first, nor the last. Have you seen the projections, the fleet auguries, the number of vessels in the local systems already? I lost interest when the numbers became too high for me to count on my fingers. Artarian snorted at his own weak jest. We will fight and win, or fight and die. All that ever changes is the color of the sky we fight under, and the shade of the blood on our blades. Very true. War never changes, once again. It's interesting how there is some, like, narration in the middle there. My brother's names are Artarian, Priamus, Cador. Nerova and Bastilan. Bastila? It's a character from uh, Knights of the Old Republic. These are the knights that have waged war beside me for decades. We are the knights of Squad Grimaldus. Within his veins, Cador carries the blessed blood of Rogal Dawn with what seems like weary honor. He is older than I, older by far. His decades within the Sword Brethren are behind him now. Primus is the rising sun to Cato. Ooh, whatever that is, looks cool. He is aware of his skills. Some kind of dagger or sword or something. Way of many young warriors. Like the knuckle duster on the on the guard. Himself. It is not mistaken. Yeah, like all their armor, it looks Artarian sick. Is... <laughs> Artarian. My shadow, just as I am his. It is rare among our number for any knight to lay aside personal glory, yet Artarian is the one who carries my banner into battle. Nerova is the newest among us. The squad requires the like a... presence of an apothecary. It's got like a in chainsaw the on his, the his forearm. That's his very cool. Endurance. Very, um, Bastilan is last. Gears of War. Bastilan, Although, Gears of War is probably a leader, but not inspired by 40k, if anything. Presence, but not I'm pretty sure 40k has been around for a really long time. A sergeant, never fated to rise as a Castellan or Marshal. Would love to know how long it's been around for. 
He went down. My brothers go through the same rituals of checking and rechecking. A curious sense of unease descends upon me. Shit. <laughs> and I am. I'm such a missile magnet. That's like the fourth ship that's been shot down. Well, I've been around today. <laughs> Yeah, that's a whole ass sword. That's pretty cool. And there is talk of the High Marshal nominating you to lead a crusade. Kind of looked like it might have be like a chainsaw sword, which would be even It is my belief. Even I'm cooler. <laughs> of your fallen master that you should take the honor we offer you now. You have waged war at my side for 200 years, Grimaldus. Will you stand at my Wait, what? side as reclusiarch of the Eternal Crusade? That's right. They they age slowly. He said he's been fighting for 200 years. Can you imagine? Like, wouldn't you just want to die at some point? It's not enough war for one per one one lifetime. Jesus. I dub the Reclusiarch of the Eternal Crusade as a Knight of the Inner Circle. Let that be the last blow you receive unanswered. So, my leash. As it should be. I'm getting like a bad guy vibe from this, this uh, group in this story. Is there like good and bad? I guess it's all from a certain point of view. Nice. Yeah, that was really cool. Thank you for um you know who you are. <laughs> Thank you for suggesting that. Uh if yeah, if anyone else would like to see any other um see me react or like suggest any other videos, shoot, go for it. I'd love to watch them. I'd love to learn more about 40k as well. Like I said, I probably never like play it, but uh yeah, the visuals are really cool. Uh the lore seems pretty neat. Yeah, so catch you on the next one. Thanks. Right, let's get back to the game here. Just let me change scenes. So I don't see the strings behind everything here. Alright. Yes, we were besieged, beset by these assassin droids. Sassoon. Is there any particular reason why he shot down my ship? First option here. <laughs> Taking out one of you would be easy. Uh, fighting all of you, I might break a sweat. <laughs> no, I want to know why they shut me down. Unnecessary clarification. We merely wish to cripple your vessel. Once we tracked your coordinates, we were able to deploy several droids in this location. Probing query. We are, however, curious as to why you chose to come to the remnants of the Polar Telos irrigation system. There is nothing here that our instruments can detect. Eager threat. But we are looking forward to extracting your motives for coming here when we place you in torture restraints. <laughs> okay, that's a little, little menacing. Yeah, but like, you still didn't really say why you're here. Is one we put to you. What are 
are you doing here? We wonder. I see. So these guys are uh, probably employed by the Empire trying to get us here. All right, I'm done asking questions. We're, we're doing the... I can take down one of you, but all of you, I'll probably, probably break a sweat. Fucking go for it. Yeah, add-on. Let's level you up. I think we'll stick with add-on. Oh shit, no. Uh, on to auto level, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Make sure he's in the right stance, he is. All right. Ah! Fuck him up. More where that came from. Shit, I'm almost dead. Oh shit, Kira's down. I was not paying attention at all. That's alright. Full of force juice here. Is it some health back? There's only two now. It's not that promising actually. <laughs> One third of the fight and we already lost someone. Alright. I have faith. You guys have faith. What even is faith? Why does it sometimes just, like, let you... Okay, that is not gonna work. We have too much health. Maybe we do... Okay, I guess we still have to use that. Let's try the advanced one. I don't know why sometimes you have to click the health pack and then click your your face for it to work. Oh damn, that's that worked really well. Nice. Okay. Well, we learned at least for my guy. I I have way too much health to be using baby med packs now. We at least have to use the advanced. Kira, join the living. It was a little bit hairy. We'll give a quick save so we don't have to do that again. <laughs> okay, well. This is kind of shit. <laughs> what do we do now? Uh, looks like there's a little lump here. Actually, what's this? Oh, is he knocked out? Bo! Okay. Yeah, we gotta find some shelter or some shit. What are we on, by the way? Some, like, big plateau shit. There, I'm feeling like there's probably a door on the other side of this mound. I mean, it's the, literally the only place looks like that we can go. Except for our ship. A. Hey. Hopefully, hopefully they're friendly in here. Ah, uh, it's the... Okay, yeah. I, I was saying this earlier. Is it, there was a girl in white that stole our ship. She was like albino, kind of.
This is the this is the one. Lay down your weapons, and you shall not be harmed. They're like clones, kind of. They all look the same, I think. Interesting. Interessante. Um. I will Who are you? you again. Drop your weapons, or we shall take them from you. Do as they say. I sense people come to no harm. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah. I mean, if we can get through this without a fight, I'm, I'm okay with it. Yeah, very well. Why is it that everywhere we go, I end up in a cell? I mean, why did they lock us up? What is this place? It is a training ground for Jedi. What? This ice hole? Yes. Bo's head is outside the cell? Academy. But where are all the students? I don't know if that's, that doesn't You've look comfortable at all. What is a Jedi Academy doing out here in the middle of nowhere? It is a place hidden from the galaxy like the Academy on Dantooine. But this place... Oh, Atris, you have been clever. Atris? It's none of your concern. Well, the sooner we're out of here, the better. Two crazy Jedi are more than enough for me. No one told me we were going to be dumped in a nest of Jedi. And what is it about this place that causes you such fear? What do you mean? We're in the middle of a bunch of Jedi. You know how they are. No, I do not. Not in the way you seem to. What? What are you doing? Wait, are they all Jedi? Get out of my head! Stop struggling. Let me follow the current. Deep, deep to its source. Stop! Stop! Ah! Ah. With the fear is mingled guilt. It squirms in you like a worm. And the why? Ah. And there is its heart. You surprise me. I could not feel it before. Your feelings are a powerful shield indeed. Do not worry, Atten. If he is a Jedi, he will forgive. And if he is not, he will not care. You can't tell him, please. I'm asking you. I don't want him to... Think less of you. I hardly think that's possible. Still, there is no shame <laughs> She's in not wrong. Ask. Adam you is very annoying. wage war with the past. And it's such a dick. Scars. I will not speak of yours, Atten, but there is a price for such things. What? What price? There Death. are those who wage war and those who follow them. You are a crude thing, murderer, but you have your uses. You know how important this man we travel with is. Even one such as you can feel it. You will serve him until I release you. And if I refuse? You will not. If you do, then my silence will be broken. And then, Atten, you will be broken. You fear the Jedi, and rightly so. If Atris learns of your choices, you will never leave this place. But whatever fear you hold of the Jedi, know that if you disobey me, that my punishment will make you beg for the death that has long hounded you. Wipe the fear from your mind. You will not find blind obedience a difficult master. You chose it once. You will learn to embrace it again. I don't know how you became such a manipulative witch, but why a vicious old scowl like yourself would even bother with me is a bigger mystery. No game of Dejaric can be won without pawns, and this may prove to be a very long game. You are a slippery one. Your thoughts difficult for even one such as I to read. I suspect the self-loathing that squirms within you gives you a cure. Kind of suspicious of Kira too. Spirit. As diseased as it is, refuses to allow you She's to kind of her, like no matter what threats you face at whatever wreckage you kind of like evil aura about her. You have crossed our path for a reason. Perhaps even you, at the right moment, may be able to turn aside disaster. If so, she can be quite cruel. Is not yet spent. Fine, I'll be your pawn, but I still think you've got the wrong man. Perhaps, but someone has to fly the ship, and the Force is a hard thing to predict. You have crossed our path for a reason. Our path brought us here for a reason. And now I know why. The past is here, and it must be met before the future can be set in motion. Uh, more Jedi speak. Care to explain? 
No. I've wasted enough time with you. Sleep, murderer, and be silent. I need no distractions. A critical moment approaches. Well, if she could just knock people out like that, that, that would have came in handy a while ago. She's hiding something, for sure. Yeah, so they said surrounded by Jedis. Maybe he just meant me and Kira? Or maybe he meant all these people. I'm about to find out, I guess. I did not expect to see you again after the day of your sentencing. I thought you had taken the Exile's path, wandering the galaxy. Yet you have returned. Why? Uh, what? <laughs> my slaves? Are they, they're my slaves? Is that... Yeah, I didn't plan on coming here. Seems like a good option. <laughs> yeah, I was not planning on coming here. Perhaps you do not know yourself as well as you think. Regardless, your arrival here begs an explanation. Have you come to face the judgment of the Council, as you did so many years ago? Are you finally willing to admit that we were right to cast you out? Yeah, we know why we were cast out. Just a quick recap. We uh, sided with, the, we joined Revan's order, uh, which is a bit controversial, and they took our force powers away. I don't know if it was like a remote thing or what. Kind of freaky though. kind of finicky this scroll option yeah I guess it I mean kind of deserved to be exiled I mean I wasn't technically a Jedi anymore but they didn't need to take away my fucking powers, but I, that, it's a very Jedi thing to do. But yeah, just in general, I'm not really here to debate their decision. Indeed. Very well. Your exile has given you some wisdom, at least. So then answer me. How did you find this place? And why have you returned after all this time? Yeah, one of your uh, clones or some shit stole my ship. Your ship? Ah, the Ebon Hawk. It is not no. your ship. Unless you are admitting to the destruction of the Paragus mining facility. Yep, that was me. <laughs> was an accident? Had to be done. Had to be done. Mm. <laughs> but are you admitting to stealing my ship? The Ebon Hawk is here, safe. Its records and Navi computer are being dissected to determine what caused the destruction of the Paragus facility. Oh. This is the investigation team? The Council? The Jedi Council, I assume? What's left of it, anyway?
I guess we can figure out what, uh, who this lady's in charge of because, or, or what, what her position is by asking, uh, what gave you the right to take it? The destruction of Paragus gave me the right. If it is your ship, perhaps I should be questioning you as to what happened and why you destroyed the facility and murdered all the miners stationed there. Well, you see, what had happened was... Yeah, they were all, all already dead. Not true. There were some that were trapped, but I couldn't get to them. It was necessary, I think. I'm gonna plead the fifth though. I need a I need a lawyer for this for sure. <laughs> I admit to nothing? Where was that at? Here it is. Of course you admit nothing. That would require facing and examining your actions. You have not changed. Acting instead of thinking. Putting yourself before the galaxy, before the Jedi. Do you know what you have done? Uh, I think I blew up a mining station, right? <laughs> I put Telos in jeopardy? How? Yeah. Why don't you why don't you tell me what is going on? Without the fuel from Paragus, Citadel State oh, I see. cannot maintain its orbit. It will crash into the planet and its destruction will echo across 20 other worlds. Fuck. <laughs> Oops. Well, I didn't know that. Shit. Fuck shit. We're killing an entire planet of people. That's not good. I didn't know that that would happen. Why would they hit me with such a heavy decision at the beginning of the game? I don't even remember. <laughs> I don't even remember. <laughs> why, uh, why we blew it up, to be honest. Wait, 20 worlds? What the fuck? 20 worlds with one explosion, even better. I guess, yeah, what do, what do you mean? Because all the other options are like evil stuff. Telos was a test to see if the Republic could mount a restoration effort on the Outer Rim. When it fails, the Republic will not finance another. The other Rim worlds devastated by the Sith will remain graveyard worlds, devoid of life. And that is the magnitude of your crime. Shit. So yeah, we we killed like twenty worlds or something. Damn. It's almost as bad as the Jedi letting the Outer Rim die during the Mandalorian Wars. One could say. I think that's not too far fetched.
Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna continue to kind of plead the fifth here. It's like I said, I don't don't really remember why I blew it up. It seemed like the thing to do though. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna hit her with the, uh, the guilt trip of not saving the outer outer rim during uh, the, the Mandalorian Wars. So you still hold to your flawed convictions. If you think to anger me, you are wrong. How is it that you are not content to confine your ruin to yourself? You must spread it to others wherever you go. Ruin yourself with your actions if you will. But when your actions bring harm to others, then you must answer for it. Gave me like the same options again. Shit, okay, um... Yeah. The only option to continue, like, not saying anything pretty much is... Uh, I've had enough of this and you. Oh shit! I'm here to finally admit the council was right. Oh, is that my lightsaber? Shit. Yeah. Hey, lady, that's mine. A lightsaber is the mark of a Jedi. When you turned your back on the Order, it was not yours anymore. Yeah, no. I want my fucking blade back, but I don't want to fight you if that's possible. You do not wish to fight for it. You surprise me. If you do not wish Full to of surprises, fight, lady. answer my questions. What happened at Paragus? All right, I guess we got far enough pleading a fifth. Uh, we'll just say the destruction was necessary. Necessary? The destruction of Paragus was necessary? You have not changed. Acting instead of thinking, putting yourself before the galaxy, before the Jedi. Do you know what you have done? Yes, you already told me I fucking destroyed like 20 planets, okay. How do I ever repay my, my debt here? Yeah, I destroyed. No, your crime is much more than that. Without the fuel from Parag. Yeah, we've been over this. Tila, the. Oh, maybe I have to like admit admit to something here. Yeah, it was not it was not my intention to harm the out other worlds. How is it that you are not content to confine your ruin to yourself? You must spread it to others wherever you go. Ruin yourself with your actions if you will. But when your actions bring harm to others, then you must answer for it. Yeah, my bad. <laughs> All of these are like whiny, but this one's kind of okay, I guess. Yeah, so I guess I get blamed for Sith, the Sith actions now, too. The Sith? What do you mean? Ooh, piqued your interest. I guess you didn't know that the Sith were around still. 
Are they come they've they've returned? Yeah, the, the Sith were there on Paragus. They tried to kill me. You speak truly. You have encountered the Sith. I can feel the scars on you. And you encountered them on Paragus. But what would they want there? They can't have been looking for you. I'm uh, pretty sure they were looking for me. Damn. Damn. Since you were <laughs> since you were hi hiding, they came after a real Jedi. You no, know, I'm pretty sure that I was the only Jedi the only Jedi they could find. You. If they thought you were Jedi, the teachings of the Sith blind them indeed. I am the last Jedi, not you. You betrayed our teachings, our beliefs, the very core of the Jedi Order. If these Sith attacked you, they will soon realize their mistake. And if you escaped, they most likely let you go. To see if you would lead them here. You're probably right, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I was definitely followed because of those assassin droids. Unless they were her assassin droids. Still unsure. Yeah, I'll help you, uh, if you'd like. You offer your aid after turning your back on me, on the Council. The Jedi is not something you embrace out of fear. The commitment is stronger than that, something you never seem to understand. Huh? I mean, I kind of don't have anything better to do. <laughs> kind of fucked, you know? Yeah, so what, from what I understand, um, I guess depending on how you played the first game, uh, Revan isn't exactly Sith or or Jedi. He's kind of in the middle. I would say more Jedi than Sith. Um, so it would, it would make sense here that our character here, our character here, joined him, and that now he would be willing to help the Jedi over the Sith, so we'll we'll try to do that. Yeah, I'm not doing this out of fear, I want to help. Perhaps. But if you help me, it cannot be done from here. There are others in the galaxy who may help us against a Sith threat. If you can find them, gain their trust. Perhaps our defenses shall be stronger for it. Take your ship, seek them out. If you find them, encourage them to gather on Dantooine. From there, we can call a council and see what can be done. Okay. Can I have my lightsaber? I'll go find some peeps and bring him to Dantooine. Can I get my lightsaber? <laughs> then I shall send you on your way. It is now time for you to depart. We shall remove him, mistress. Come with us. 
Do they have lightsabers or like extendable staffs or something? Or they just like shock things? Who are, who are these clones? The exile brought up feelings best left forgotten. Forgive me, mistress, but I must ask. The exile. I have never seen another affect you so strongly. Did you care for him once? The Jedi have no such attachments. As always, he will do as he wills. And the galaxy and the feelings of others can burn for all he cares. The day we judged him, I stood in the chamber and he was... He was so right. He was so certain of it, I doubted myself. He chose Revan over the Jedi, over the Council, over... But now, now I am tired. I must meditate. Of course, Mistress. I will tell the others you are not to be disturbed. And please, do not exhaust yourself. We can attend to matters here. Of course I was right. The Jedi Council isn't always correct. They're kind of shady sometimes. Really want to know what's going on with these other people that's in this compound, though. Like, are they clones of her? Of this Jedi Master? Handmaiden Sister. Why have you approached me? Oh. Just want to know what's, uh, what your deal is. I'm looking for a fight. No. Yeah, I have some questions. You may ask. Yeah, why do you all look the same? We share the same father, and we all bear the face of our mother. It is not unusual for the Achani of the same parents to be born so as to be indistinguishable to outsiders. The Ichani. Interesting. Who is her mom, though? The... The council leader lady? Wait. One of them looks different? As I have said, I don't think so. It is not unusual for the Achani of the same parents to be born so as to be indistinguishable to outsiders. So she had different parents, I guess? If you seek to raise anger in me, you will fail, exile. Uh, I tolerate your presence only upon orders of the mistress. She did not order me. To endure your questions. Yeah, I mean, I was just genuinely curious. You don't need to get so pissy. Sounds like a challenge to me. No. One cannot take back an action, and often apologizing for it only compounds the insult. Simply drop the matter and be silent. Well, fucking fine, bitch. Damn. The hell? <laughs> Maybe I'll drop you. Yeah, let me try to maybe ask something else. You may ask. I'm pretty sure, I mean, so I can ask what this place is, but I, I'm pretty sure it's just the home of this uh, council member, their hideout. Yeah, I think we're done here. Not a very talkative sort. Uh, is this just...
Is that a dead end this way? Didn't seem like it. Or no, that's where the... Where the Jedi Master Lady went. Can we go in there? I'm so curious. No conventional means of opening it. Well then. Probably closed by the force or something. Or, uh... Maybe she's got some special... key card or something. Some, like, proximity... shiz. You are the exile. The one Atris warned us about. Atris. Atris is her name, right? The Jedi Councilwoman. Yeah, I guess. What did she, what did she say about me? She said... You betrayed the Jedi by going to war when it was forbidden to you. You turned on your masters, your teachings, and yourself. Yeah, but it was the right thing to do. Yeah, once again, it was necessary. That is not all she says. She says you know nothing of loyalty to any cause except your own animal instincts. And she told us why you fell to the dark side. Okay. First off, didn't fall to the dark side. I am, I am slave to, to no sides. You could say. That's even possible. Do what I want. Yes, madam, I do not walk the path of the dark side. Atris says that you fell to the dark side in the Mandalorian Wars when you gave in to your lust for battle. Once you tasted war, you could not give it up. Okay, well then explain why I kept, or I didn't keep fighting in the Civil War. Atris says, when the Dark Lord Revan returned to the Republic, you did not march with him because you had fallen so far, you could no longer feel the Force. No, they took my Force away from me. Or she did, probably herself. Yes, this is untrue, but Atris is entitled to her opinion. I believe that is the extent of her expressed feelings toward you. There are variations at times, but all rise from the same foundation. Yes, maybe I, I ask you some questions now. You may ask. Yes, you look different than the other women here. I honor the face of my mother. It is not something spoken of in the company of others. Yes, she does. She does look slightly different than the others. I mean, will she take our apology differently? 
There's no need to apologize. Oh. You were merely remarking on something that you saw. There is no wrong in that. Okay, so the bitch thing isn't... <laughs> it's not widespread. It's good to know. She seems chill. Is it a sensitive subject? It is not a sensitive subject, but a subject that requires trust. There is no such trust between you and I, and such trust takes time. All right. I got all the time in the world. You so we're ask. asking something else. I can ask about her father, I guess. I do not wish to discuss it. If there is something else you wish to ask. Ah, I see, I see. Before you go, Exile, question for you, if I may ask it. You have touched the Force. What does it feel like? Ooh, how did... How was it described in the Kenobi series? I don't remember. They did describe it, though. I think it's just, like, genuinely nice or something. It's difficult. It's a difficult thing to describe. Please, I wish to know. Damn, you'll know when you die. So unless you seek death, leave me be. <laughs> no, I like this one. I think it's somewhat similar to what Obi said in uh, Kenobi, the show. Uh, the, it's like the warmth of the sun. It's like the warmth of the sun without the glare. You can feel its light and its heat, but there's no harshness to it. That sounds nice. I see. Thank you, Exile. I appreciate you sharing your knowledge with me. You're not calling me Exile. The name's Viz. You just say that. It's a bit awkward. Yeah. Be glad to answer any other questions you have. Mind side points. Hmm. Okay. This would be a nice. Let's see if we can get any loot from here. Probably can, right? This is a big place. How many handmaidens are around this part? Regal visor. What's that thing look like? Got one defense on that. Charisma? I don't know how that gives you charisma. You look really goofy with it on. Strength enhancer. Juicing? Strength. Dexterity? Defense plus one, though. Fortitude plus one and strength. I think fortitude... Or fortitude and strength is better than dexterity and defense. If only just a bit. I don't think dexterity really helps us that much. 
I could be wrong. Also, I haven't noticed. Does the belt change? Does it look different? Can you change belts? That one's green. Hmm, I don't think so. We're not really going for fashion, because this game's actually kind of hard. Sometimes. So we do want... Do you want the, uh... Best stat gear. Best defensive gear, I think. It's the way to go. Then, uh, if we can squeeze in any attack boosts. Any damage boosts in there. Not bad either. Mandalorian combat suit. Ooh. Mando armor? Okay, I'm interested. It's 10 plus 3. What does it look like, though? Okay, that looks like shit. What the fuck? The disgrace to the Mandalorian name? Never again? We're gonna have to... Maybe it's like meant to... Be a little gear check time in the game. We're gonna have to run, run back through the gear after looting this stuff. Make sure everyone's got the best stuff on. Did you find what you came for? I suppose so, yeah, I've been given a chance to help the Jedi. I had thought that would bring you some peace, yet I still sense some unrest in you. There was something from your past here, something unresolved. I feel we did not come to this place by chance. You were led here. This woman who resides here, she did something to you once, something that hangs upon you still. Yeah, she took my fucking lightsaber. Bitch, she still has it. She can give it back. Wouldn't, wouldn't exactly call her charming. <laughs> Damn, the dark side choices are so good in this game. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to come back and play it. Uh, Yeah, she's a part of the council that exiled me. She wanted to punish me even further. <gasps> I see it now. The act has left its marks. Be warned. Unresolved events from our past can create wounds in the present and the future. And more importantly, they can distract you, weaken you. It could prove fatal against the enemies we face. All right, all right, all right. Let's just go. Very well, let us depart. Ah. <sighs> All right, let me turn these off and let's get out of here. I am sorry, General. I must have lost consciousness in the crash. Damn, we can really blame him for being knocked the fuck out. That's not that's not cool though. Yeah, there's nothing to apologize for. Uh, are you are you are you okay? I'm fine, General. Even power has been restored to my arm. What is this place? Where are we?
Yeah, we can talk later. Very well, General. I will await your arrival. Nice. Yeah, let's do that thing I was talking about. Let me make sure everyone's wearing the best stuff. What all do we pick up? I think just that visor and a blaster. Just we say the word. What is it? Make add-on. Just say the word. The dunce. <laughs> make him wear that silly thing. Will. Awareness. Hammer's resistance. Okay. Probably better. Weapon focus, blaster rifle. Yeah, persuade plus two, charisma. We don't really need that for him. Uh, there was some resistance on one of these. It's probably best. Yeah. One to twelve. One to twelve. Three to twenty-two. Holy shit. Yes. Yes, yes. yes. That seems like the way. Heavy repeating carbine. That seems very strong. Damn. God damn. Oh yeah, look at that thing. Fucking huge. It's I huge. Wait. Uh, do we not have... Okay, she has her sword. Where the fuck is mine? Three to twelve. <laughs> Here it is. Now I can murder everyone. Yeah, that was a question. It was like, why is she letting me walk freely around here? I can just kill every single one of you. Suppose she trusts me on some sort of level. What was that? N another pistol? Pistola? Yeah, it's a pistol. I don't want that. Especially when we got this thing. This big old cannon. Nerve enhanced system? I don't think my guy has any systems on. Immunity to stun, fear, horror. Okay. Yes, yes. She got one, yeah. I really probably should run some shield of some sort. I'm just gonna wait until like I die. I'll start running them, I guess. Well, Hello. if it isn't the one who stole the Ebonhawk. Not so smug now, are you, you little thief? Don't be a fool. Atris stole the ship and the droid, says you. You don't blame it on T3. He's just a prisoner. I don't I don't think we would have been We didn't just find him now. Will we lose him forever? <laughs> so you've just been relaxing while we've been running all over Telos, I see. Yeah, I figured you'd just be a pile of scrap. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't want him to think it was his his fault that uh. 
they successfully stole the ship. I could tell him, uh, then maybe he should have fought, but no. <laughs> He's not really a combat droid. Not really his job. Maybe I should hire one. <laughs> Ooh, he's got some some de some juicy details about something. Oh shit! What? She downloaded his memory. What the fuck? I'm not really surprised. I guess I'd probably do the same thing. Yeah, what console did it get downloaded to? I must delete that shit. No, let's just get you out of here. Yeah, go, sh go secure the ship. I'm gonna loot. <laughs> I'm gonna take them for all they're worth. Ooh, I see me a loot container right now. Hell yeah. I wish I could just, there was just an option to create a lightsaber. I gotta, yeah, again, I gotta look that up. So we got like a lightsaber hilt. It doesn't seem like we're going to be getting our lightsaber back from Atris. Damn thief. It's very bright hallway. Probably going down to the hangar. Not sure I'm ready to leave quite yet. I think there's some more, some more, uh, some more rooms to search through. This game for me seems to have like. Just the right amount of areas to explore and loot. Did we miss this? Nice. It all it, it like always seems to have some decently uh, worthwhile things. Like it, it's definitely worth it to search through everything. Seemingly, anyway. And then it also has some... Some areas, uh... Right. Okay, I think we did search through everything then. Yeah. Then it has some, like, realistic areas that are just locked because, like, I don't know. Like, yeah. That, that closet is just locked. We just keep it locked. There's no reason. There's nothing in there. <laughs> it's just locked. Alright, let's get out of here. Just kidding, we're gonna loot the hangar. <laughs> That's weird, I just realized that I can look up and down. At least up, anyway. 
the crane is poorly rendered. Hold on. I think there's some stuff over here. Possibly. Just some oddly shaped uh, barrier or something? <laughs> Pretty sure it's just meant to block us from going all the way out of the hangar. Yeah, let's blow the, the freaking popsicle stand. Yeah, so are these also Jedi? Mistress, the last of the or handmaidens? Says not among us. She has left with the exile. Oh shit, she's a stowaway? Hi. Left? But why? She seems cool. Her oath. Her reasons are unknown to me. But I fear she may no longer be trusted. We will save her if we can, but we must let her discover the exile's nature for herself. Some evils must be confronted, and isolation from it would have been no defense. I win her over, I think. That's even possible. Now she probably that Dajaric board of a planet. I say we burn sky until we see lines. She probably follows you regardless. She's got that main character energy. <laughs> Droids sure making a lot of noise. What did you do while you were connected? What? <laughs> Downloaded her archives. What a thug. Hell yeah. Maybe you could actually come in handy sometimes. Good job, T3. What is the machine saying? Ooh, juicy. There's a hollow of my trial. Yeah, go ahead and blast that shit on the big screen, T3. Do you know why we have called you here? I assume to answer for my crimes on Malachor 5. As Revan summoned you, so have you come full circle to return to the Jedi. Why did you defy us? The Jedi are guardians of the peace, and have been for centuries. This call to war undermines all that we have worked for. Is Revan your master now? Or is it the horror you wrought at Malachor that has caused you to see the truth at last?
Yeah. The truth is, the Mandalorians had to be stopped, or countless more would have died. You refuse to hear us. You have shut us out. And so have shut yourself to the galaxy. You are exiled, and you are a Jedi no longer. There is one last thing. Your lightsaber. Surrender it to us. Oh, damn, I thought he's... <laughs> he fucking walked up and shanked him. That pillar kind of looks like a chair. <laughs> it's an interesting way What's to surrender. On that one? You were correct, Kavar. When he was here, I felt it. It was as if he was not there. More like an echo. The war has touched the youngest of the Order. Many of them have lost themselves in battle against the Mandalorians. We have not lost a Jedi this day. You felt it. He has lost himself. He is no Jedi. He walked Revan's path, but he was not strong enough. I fear it is our teachings that may have led Revan to choose the path he did. We are not the ones who taught him. We take responsibility, Atris, not cast blame. The choice of one was the choice of us all. Revan's teacher intended no harm, and Revan had many teachers since. Yet they all stem from the same source. Her teachings violated the Jedi Code, and lead all who listen to the Dark Side, as they did the Exile. You are wrong. The Dark Side is not what I sensed in the Exile. Surely the rest of you felt it as well. That emptiness we felt. He has changed. Whatever that wound was, it was of the Dark Side. We should not have let him depart. He will simply join Revan again, or perhaps worse. What would you have done with him, Atris? Be mindful of your feelings. This is not Revan who stood before you. This one walks a different path. No, although that may come in time. We let him go because we must. Where he travels, he carries his destination with him. Malachor V should have been his grave. You saw it in his walk, and in the Force. It was as if he was already dead. No, not death. Many battles remain for that one. If what we have seen is true, but the future is a shifting thing, and he cuts like a blade through it. We should have told him the truth. I like this guy. Yet I deserve <laughs> to know. No good would have come. Yeah, Atris is very what you believe opinionated. There is still the matter of Revan, and such truths could leave us vulnerable on two fronts. Perhaps in many years we will call him before us and explain what happened to him, and how he may be healed. Until then, he must accept his journey. But he may never discover the truth, and he will never know why we cast him out. And that is the future we must accept. I'm sure we discover the truth. Secrets, don't they? Bastards, so yeah, they knew. So you have a list of all the Jedi. Sick. That's this is gonna be cool as shit. Finding lost Jedi or hiding Jedi. Yeah, but what else do we have? What about artifacts, lightsabers? Mm, I guess there's nothing about lightsabers or artifacts. Okay, uh, play the missing Jedi then. Okay, all the ones on the council. Okay, yeah, they were all on the council when I was exiled. Coincidence. It is no coincidence. There is some larger plan at work here, and we are walking into it. This is too convenient to be anything but a trap. It's a trap!
Yeah, either way, we need their help against the Sith. Hello. Those are Atris's records you have stolen. What the hell are you doing on our yep. ship? I have come to join you. I can help you against this threat. Well, we don't want your help. Or any of your sisters. It is just me. It's not true. I am doing this the fuck because Atris believes you will need help. Hey, I'll take whatever help I can get. Indeed. But Seemed pretty course, cool too. What does one more matter to our journey? I have had enough of this. I will be in my chambers. Yeah, me too. I'll be in my chambers. But since I don't have any, I guess I'll just go to the cockpit like I always do. If yep. she's coming Where you belong at, Tom. Nobody wants to hear your, your shit. Locked up. General. The cargo hold is enough. I assure you, there is little I need. I will attend to myself. All right. Mm, that's true. She should. She could just be a spy for Atris. Atris. But I mean, it showed us that clip of her being mad that she was gone. That she stood away with us. So I don't think so. Unless that was some crazy like Jedi mind trick that she put into her head. I don't think so. Yeah, no, uh, don't worry about Adon. You can take his bunk. <laughs> it is no matter. I am used to worse conditions, but thank you for your kindness. Sick. It's an excellent, excellent unarmed fighter. Interesting. General, is there a reason you don't carry a lightsaber anymore? You know, I would if I could build one. That's not your lightsaber anymore. That belonged to someone who served Revan in the wars, not the person you are now. You could build another one if you wanted to, but you know that. Yeah, I'm definitely not afraid of building a new one. I never said you were, but whatever the reason, you should put it behind you. I know this. A lightsaber is part of who you are. Without it, you're not complete. This is true. Yeah, I guess, uh, yeah, we're, how do we start? I think I can help you out there. I have Shit, to yeah. know the parts you need. All right, yeah, what do, we, what do we need? We need a power cell, emitter matrix, lens and focusing crystal. Though I have to admit the crystal is beyond my means. Never did understand them. Those parts are fairly common, though a Jedi once told me that it's best if your lightsaber reflects you, and if it is constructed of things that identify it as your own. Just bring the parts to me before you get started building it. I'll make sure they're usable. Hmm. All I'm saying is that you've gone for a long time without a memory wipe. Most droids behave erratically under those circumstances. I know that, but I'm fixing everything else around here, so I may as well take a look at you, too. What was that? That's what I'm talking about. That is not normal droid <laughs> behavior. You are abnormal droid. Stop. Stop being unique. Hmm. <laughs> 
This utility droids tend to uh, develop personalities. I kind of like it. I am not pushing you around. I just wanted to see if there was anything I could do to upgrade your functionality. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Dang. Yeah, it... <laughs> At the very worst, we could always just get another utility droid. No. Yeah, don't worry. He, he probably knows what he's doing. No worry, droid. Thanks for the vote of confidence. Good. Now let's get started. You wouldn't guess it from the outside, but it looks like you've been through a lot. I'll bet. I'm all done with you. If anything comes loose, let me know and I'll put it back in place. Permanent plus two constitution. Nice bow. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Okay. Uh... General, need something. Let me see what parts I already have for this. Uh, my lightsaber. Okay, because we don't have anything. He can continue to call me General. General, it's cool. I earned it. Uh, I kind of don't want to interview a bunch of people right now. Uh, let's see what quests we have. Okay, so we have a list of a bunch of planets to go to to try to find um, the missing Jedi Masters, which we'll probably get to in a second. So you have that back on Telos, which is doomed. It's going to be a wasteland in a bit, so that's not going to happen. Crafting lightsaber, yeah, we're working on it. False... Yeah, the TSF blaster shit. Okay. Uh, let's go. Pick a planet to go to. Pretty sure there's one on, like, every planet. Shit. Um, is this the cockpit? Yeah. Okay, it doesn't tell- I was wondering if it would tell us what quests we had on the planet. Which it doesn't. Okay, so we can either go... Dantooine, which I'm pretty sure is like... A, uh... A desert? Not my favorite. Korriban. Ooh, Korriban sounds interesting. I've seen some things about it. It's like the, uh, the old Sith... Because the Sith have taken it over, it's like their biggest uh, training area. Maybe say that for last. It sounds really interesting. Um, Narshada, very cool. Very, very, very cool. Um, maybe that one for the very last. I really like the uh, the like New York downtown style cities in uh, Star Wars. I think they look really cool. Andoran? Hmm. Okay, I'm pretty sure Dantooine... Dantooine is a... Maybe I'll just go with the one I'm not sure of. Andoran. I have no idea what that one's gonna be. I guess we can probably see. From our little display. Yeah, it's that one. Andoran. Do I even have that? Andoran. Forest. Okay. Yeah, I kind of want to do, like, my least favorite to 
most interesting planet. Dantooine, I'm pretty sure, is a desert planet, which, I mean... I don't know, maybe you like desert planets. I don't really, though. Grassland? Yeah. Yeah, Korriban has some lore. Narshada is really cool. Andron is a... Forest. Okay, yeah, I think we'll go grassland, forest, uh, Sith temple, Nashida. Which Dantooine was it? Yes. Let's go. Let's do it. Oh, I think I remember this. I think I remember this area from the first game. I want to say it was where, like, the. or a. Jedi school was. Yeah, we're definitely going to take our new party member. So I want to kid her out. Like the most interesting character so far, I think. Take her. Our trusty healer. Yeah. Another visitor? You must be here to join in the plunder of the old Jedi Enclave. You have to see Administrator Adari first. Yeah, that's what it was, the Jedi Enclave. Yeah, what are they doing in the Enclave? Salvagers are stripping it of anything valuable. Mostly they're collecting trash the Jedi left behind. The Enclave was bombed during the war, so there's not much left. The halls hmm. of the Enclave are meant for Jedi. The artifacts left behind could prove dangerous in the wrong hands. We should investigate. But since you're a Salvager, I expect you already know all that. Hmm. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, what? I mean, I'm not really a salvager. I do. I am a loot goblin, but it's just interesting why she'd call me that. Then who are you? The only recent visitors we've had on Dentuin have been salvagers and a slew of mercenaries. Oh, sorry. In that case, yes, I'm. I am. I am salvager. <laughs> I'm not suspicious at all. I guess I lived here once. It's not saying that it's a lie. Really? You seem pretty well armed for a farmer. But a <laughs> lot of us joined the military during the Jedi Civil War. This is your first time back. A lot has changed. You may want to go into Kunda and ask around about your family. There was a lot of movement when the Sith invaded. Hopefully everybody you knew is safe. Right. Just head into the building and you'll find your way to the administrator. I'll be over by the entrance if you need anything else. Alrighty then. Maybe we get some sick ass threads or something. I don't know. Oh yeah, I wanted to. We gotta upgrade. Ready. What's this lady's name? Handmaiden. 
Handmade in Soldier 6? Is that really your name? Oh, she's a, she's a soldier, and she's level 6. I see. Now she's level 10. Okay. Nice. Uh, it said that she had, like, unarmed skills. Maybe I should look at her layout. How do I look at her skills? Her abil abilities. I kind of see what to give her. I guess you kind of can't, huh? I didn't even know you could turn your people around. Very jankily. What does she have, though? What is this? Oh, okay, she's got a staff. Alright, so she's melee. Even though it said that she's specializes in unarmed, which is interesting. Whatever. She's definitely going to have a weapon if she's in my party. <laughs> Can't be having people weaponless. What would they think of me? Okay, uh, poison, dexterity, probably might be good for her, I don't know. Definitely not that weird haunches thing. Haunches? That's like your butt, right? <laughs> Whatever, like it goes like, I don't know, that face, the, that headgear adds charisma, looked weird. Damage immunity, no. Nah. Yeah, bonus damage, pretty good. Or defense, I mean. Defense plus three, okay. Wait, she can wear heavy armor? What? Nice. Because she is a warrior, or soldier. Sorry. Defense. Four defense, three. Go with a combat suit. I wonder if this is gonna change her look. I feel like it, she has a very distinct look, and it probably won't. Place your bets in the comments. In the comments, in the chat, if you know, and our comments, I guess, if you're watching on YouTube. Uh, defense. What's this thing? 212. Mm. Yeah, definitely the best. Yeah. Hey, look at her. Okay, that's that's pretty cool. I was not expecting it to let us change her appearance. It's pretty neat. How many earrings does she have? Or is that just her hair? Hard to tell. Either way, she looks she looks really cool. I like her style. Was this the way we we're supposed to go? I just kind of want to get inside the enclave, and then I'll probably. I just want to see what's going on in there, and then we'll probably end the stream. Thank y'all for coming out. If and you did, and you're still here, you're a bloody legend. Appreciate y'all. It's a random footlocker, don't mind if I do. Hmm, this was not exactly where I thought we were. Check it out anyway. Oh. Hey, get away from that door. 
The last time somebody messed with it, it was locked down for months before we could fix it. Well, that was the first interaction of that sort. <laughs> this is not where I'm supposed to be. I'm supposed to go talk to someone to let me into the enclave. And we'll show. Do you actually believe a Jedi would return here? After all they've done to us? They wouldn't dare. They certainly would. Well, you remember how they were. Always so superior, so arrogant, and never lending a hand when we really needed them. I still don't believe it. You should. My cousin's friend, he used to tend the gardens around the Enclave. He swears he saw a Jedi in Kunda. Could be hiding anywhere. Well, I hope it's true. I hear there's a bounty on them, and we could certainly use the money. Unless somebody beats you to it. Oh my god, the gossip. Receptionist. Welcome to Kunda. You're a salvager, right? You'll need to see Administrator Adare to get access to the ruins. If you need directions to anything else, just ask. Alright. Yeah, where's the where's this dude at? Her office is directly behind this room. You really can't oh, miss sorry. it. Sorry. She can see you now if you like. Do that. Alright. Behind you? This one? Be the one? A visitor. Please, come in. Welcome to Kunda. I am Administrator Turina Adare. You're the owner of the, um, ship that just landed? That would be mine. Yes. Her, her face looks like extra... Like, well done. Oddly very detailed. Wonder why. Yep, it is a pleasure to meet you. My name is Viz. Depending on your business here, the pleasure may be mutual, but you didn't answer my question. Is that ship yours? Yes. I thought I said that. What? And unless I'm much mistaken, that's the Ebon Hawk. That vessel has been on Dantooine before, during the war. That was a Jedi vessel. Mayhaps. What's it to you? Yeah, what's your point? My point is that the previous owner of that ship was a very influential Jedi. And Jedi are not as admired here as they once were. Right or wrong, our settlers blame the Jedi and their hidden enclave for their suffering. I remember the old Jedi Masters and the considerable help they lent to Dantooine. I still maintain discreet connections with Jedi. I suppose your arrival here is no coincidence. Well, it's funny you'd say that because I'm actually looking for some Jedi. My friend, let's just call him Frook. We've known each other for many years, and our continued friendship could create many problems in the current political climate. He came to Dantooine not too long ago. He was looking into something quite important. He's gone missing recently. Did he send for you in case something went wrong?
Hmm, should we lie to her? Say yes, he did send for me. Hmm, strange. Fork it, I'm gonna do it. We need the skills of a Jedi. Hell yeah. Ever. He was helping investigate Asgul and his mercenaries, but he had his own errand to run in the Enclave. Jedi business of some sort. He went into the sub-level, which isn't without its dangers, and he hasn't returned. Mm hmm. Intriguing. Yes, go on. I'm starting to fear the worst. Would you be willing to go to the ruins of the Enclave to look for him? Certainly. Ooh, yes. Do you have any extra supplies to help me with the dangers of the ruins? From what I know of your type, you have all of the equipment you need to deal with the sublevel. I do realize the Jedi ordered disbanded, so you must find credits yourself, however. The sublevel is dangerous enough that the salvages have not managed to properly search it. There are many artifacts of value. Normally, I ask for a percentage of all salvage. In your case, however, you can take whatever you find without the customary tie. I will have one of the militia transmit permissions to the Enclave's security door. Go expecting danger, for you will most certainly find it there. Is there anything else I can assist you with? Hmm. Let me see. Cause there's maybe some side quests we could start. Yeah, is there any work I can do here? There are plenty of opportunities to assist people on Dantuin. Too many, I'm afraid. I would go to the militia headquarters and make your intentions known there. Besides that, just listen and ask around. All right. Okay, there was like a, there was, there was an option to ask what the dangers were of the sub-level, but I guess it's going to remain a mystery until Sunday. That is right. I will be back Sunday at uh, 11 p.m. EST. I uh, hope you all have a good rest of your week. I'm going to find someone to raid here. Oops. <laughs> Continue playing that song or the... Vid Vidya, we we watched. Let's see who's who's on right now. Ooh, the duck. The duck is on. What up, duck? Yeah, we'll give him a raid. Why not? Why is he not showing up? So annoying. Start the raid up here. Yeah, I'll see y'all on Sunday. Hope y'all have a good 